Justice Party presidential candidate Shim Sang-jong has resumed her election campaign after days of self-reflection amid low approval ratings. Shim says she misjudged the reality. She then vowed to bring to public attention issues that so far have been off-limits among the Liberals. Meanwhile, People's Party presidential candidate Anter Su says the government's supplementary budget bill is worse than the way past authoritarian governments tried to sway voters with money. Greedy, incompetent, and the Democratic Party's copycat are words that have been used to describe Shim sang jong This is how the Justice Party's presidential nominee self-reflects on her missteps. Sim's remarks are believed to reflect her failure to respond appropriately to the Choguk scandal while collaborating with the Democratic Party during the introduction of the mixed-member proportional representation system ahead of last year's general elections. Sim has vowed to regain trust for herself and her party during this presidential election campaign. She says she will abide by principles without blaming others. She promised to tackle social issues that so far have been off limits in the liberal camp, such as privileged liberals. On Tuesday, Shim visited the Green Party to discuss climate change response and a single liberal presidential candidate. People's Party presidential nominee Anto Su blasted the government for its supplementary budget bill as a gift for the ruling party ahead of the presidential election. Anne is calling for adjusting the bill so it produces no national debt. On Tuesday, Anne met with Professor Choi jin a harsh critic of President Moon Jae-in, in a bid to further extend his reach.